The custom slideshow feature allows you to create a custom show based upon any of the slides that you have in the presentation you're currently working on. And the benefit behind that is that if you've got a lot of groups that you're giving the presentation to, and let's say for the sake of argument, you got three groups, beginning, intermediate, and advanced. So for the beginning group, you can see I got a total of 17 slides. Let's say I give them a presentation that includes slides one through five. Then the intermediate group, I give the presentation from six to 17. And then the advanced group, I give it from, let's see, well, scattered slides like two, five, eight, 15. In any case, instead of hiding and unhiding those uh, slides in the presentation, as I'm bouncing around from group to group to group, back and forth, instead what I can do is I can create a custom slideshow for each of those groups, beginning, intermediate, and advanced, so I don't have to hide and unhide, I can just go right to that custom slideshow. So to set this up, come up here and click on the slideshow tab, go to the start slideshow group, click on custom slideshow drop down arrow, and we currently don't have any custom slideshows that we can view, so first of all we have to set it up, go ahead and click on custom shows, and you can see it's blank, nothing to show. Let's come up here, click on New, and it has two things in the window here. First of all, you can give it a name, like this could be for my, my beginning group. And let's go ahead and do Slides 1, and if you hold down your Shift key and I click on 8, it does Block Selection, so from the first slide here down to number 8, and you can hold down your Control key and be able to select individual slides there. So I can control click 11, control click, let me scroll down, 14, and say OK. That's for my beginning group, or beginners, click on Add. And then I can select the uh, slides, and I can even reorder them, saying, OK, slide 6 is no longer slide 6, let's go ahead in this custom show. That's the first slide I want to cover for beginners. So you still have the marking of the slide, that that's slide 6, but it's going to be the first slide in the custom show presentation for beginning. And then, of course, I can go ahead and select them and remove them. And then when I'm finished, click Okie Dokie, and that's it. It's right there, okay? Let's go ahead and do one more. Let's go ahead and click New. And this one could be for Intermediate. And then we can do, well, let's say the last slide's 10. Shift-click 17 to select all of them. Click Add. Uh, that's good enough. Click Okie Dokie, and now we got two shows. Cool. So I can go ahead and let me close out. To begin the show, come up here, click on Custom Show, and I can go to Beginning. It starts the slideshow, but it only contains those slides that I've added to that custom show beginning. Click, 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 okay, click. Ooh, fancy, click, 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 click. We're going really fast. Okay, that's the end. It wasn't all 17, hit the Escape key. And then you can click on Custom Show and go to Intermediate. Then if you need to go ahead and customize that, go back to Custom Shows, select it, click Edit, and, you know, remove them, add some, reorder them. You get the idea. Let's click Cancel. You can also go ahead and remove. Or if you want something like the beginning show, click Copy, and then go ahead and select it and click Edit. And then you've got a copy of that. You can go ahead and simply remove one or two. I mean, if it's not that far off, it's good to copy. Let's click Cancel.